So what we've got here, we've got a, uh, a bearing housing, and these were for, it's for a cutlass bearing. This is very old style. These went in here, a number of these, seven or eight of these, were pushed in and formed um, a cutlass bearing, which is a, a water uh, lubricated bearing for a prop shaft for a boat. Problem, they don't make these things anymore. This is uh, from East Hope, and uh, they don't have any old stock anymore. So what we're doing here is that instead of using these, we're putting in a, a new modern cutlass bearing. Problem is, this fits the shaft perfectly, but this piece on the other part here will not fit the piece in here. So at the present time, I'm machining this to fit inside here and then we'll go, all go together and uh, you'll never know that it's, uh, it's a repair. I'm just gonna start the machine up here and let you watch it. So we're just taking off a, a few thousandths of an inch at a time, just creeping up on the dimensional size. And once we're at the right size, we'll, uh, we'll fit it in. We're going to be putting a keeper uh, screw in it so that in the future, uh, you're going to be able to take this back out again and replace it. But uh, as you can see, we're getting nice shavings coming off the, uh, off the tool here. Let's see, we're taking off about two or three thousand at a time. You don't want to take off more, otherwise we'll start to chatter. These are the kind of pieces that we like to see coming off here. It's all curly and just perfect. One interesting thing about uh, lathes is that you should never, ever use compressed air to clean off your lathe. Never, ever uh, use this. I've seen people do this. It's the worst thing you can do because all these little bits, there's all special gears in here, threads, everything runs in special um, tolerances and you get some of this stuff in there so what you do you get a brush and you just brush it off and basically it takes a bit of brushing but this way you're not getting the stuff all on your uh, on your shafts and on your threads and everything else so it keeps the job pretty clean anyway that is it and uh, we keep on carrying on